everyone and welcome to my channel. I, it's my first actual vlog and I think it's on something that means a lot to me. It's something that I think deserves a moment to talk about, right? I, it's Memorial Day weekend and a lot of us, most of us in, in the US have work off tomorrow. And a lot of us don't realize why we have work off tomorrow. And I've noticed across social media and with people that I know in my life, a lot of the focus has become sales and celebrations. And that's how I'm putting it. So we're getting sales pushed down our throats. I mean, that's what holiday weekends are for nowadays. It, the companies know that it's a time to spend and a time to grab consumers' attention, which I understand being from a marketing background, I completely understand that, but what companies and individuals aren't recognizing is that the celebrations that they are having tomorrow on Memorial Day, they're because of the servicemen and women who have given their lives for this country. They are not recognizing the thousands and thousands of men and women who have sacrificed their lives for this country. And it, it's frustrating to me, being from a family who respects veterans very highly. I have family who has been in the military. Um, I just have a really high level of respect for them. And I think a lot of people who are from families that also have that background feel the same way. I know that there are some people that do still understand like what Memorial Day is all about but we're not teaching the younger generation the kids that we're raising we're not acknowledging it to the degree that we should be uh, we should be explaining what Memorial Day is we should be giving time to remember and appreciate and respect those men and women who did give their lives for this country to remember them to memorialize them because that's what it's all about and I think the news media does cover it to a degree, but I think that it should be more, more understood amongst the American population. I think that we need to acknowledge it more than we do now. And the people that I hear complaining and whining and about, about the silliest things about, you know, the weather, it's gloomy outside. I, there are things that you can't do this weekend and how you're, you know, mad about them. Maybe it's ruining your barbecue. You know, you can take it inside, but they can't give their lives back. You can't give them their, their lives back. And they sacrificed so much in their lives and in their families and all those military families, so much respect for them. I appreciate them. I appreciate all of those veterans that are still here today, all of the soldiers that we've lost, all of those who are involved in some capacity with the United States military who allow us to live freely the way that we do today, all of the leadership who acknowledges Memorial Day for what it really is. That's what it's all about. It's all about just taking a few minutes to recognize those people, all of them, for centuries, what they gave so that we're where we are today. We're able to celebrate, and we should celebrate, but it's important to remember what, what we're celebrating and why we have the ability to celebrate. It's because of them. So I hope that those of you who are going to celebrations this weekend, who have family, especially those that are younger, I hope that you will allow yourselves to take a few minutes just to think and to remember and to acknowledge what this is all about, why, why we're able to celebrate. And uh, I think it's really important. I hope that you'll spread the message too with those in your lives and those that you see on across social media, it's, it's a day for remembrance and I hope that everybody remembers and acknowledges that. So that's just my food for thought and I thank you guys for listening and I hope that you're having a great weekend and I also hope that you'll take the time just to remember, even if it's just a minute. Thank you guys and I'll see you in my next video.